Hey, so I'm in Visual Studio 2013, and this is the first install I've done of Update 3. And what's quite cool about this is there's a lot of new project types that are there. We've got inside JavaScript, we've got store apps, multi-device hybrid apps, Node.js applications. Um, but what I noticed was this one down here, the TypeScript one. And inside this TypeScript folder, we now have Node.js uh, TypeScript applications. So a kind of base template for TypeScript applications building on Node.js. And what's more, they've even got this uh, blank Microsoft Azure Node.js web application template. It's a bit of a, a bit of a mouthful. But it's quite cool because what this does is allows us to create a Node.js application using TypeScript. Um, so using that TypeScript precompiler um, and then putting it straight onto Azure. So we can say Node.js web application 4, press OK. It will create um, the project template. So the base files, we've got this uh, server.ts, which is you know your standard kind of hello world application in Node. If I then go and build this, the build inside of Visual Studio is going to convert all those TS files into JavaScript files, although this is fundamentally JavaScript anyway. Um, and then I am going to just then right click this and click publish, publish it over to Azure websites, click on a new one. My love. Stick it on a subscri subscription. Um, I'll place it inside of North Europe, which is Dublin. Create that. It will go off. It will provision a number of machines. Install all my. Um, or get ready to install my code on Azure. And when it's finished, it will come back with a, a publish file, uh, a publish sort of configuration, which allow me to do web deploy. So I can just go click on publish. take my code, publish it up to Azure, stick it on a machine which is instantly scalable. I could have one node or lots of different nodes running this website. And there we go, my lovely node app.azure websites. We have this simple uh, Hello World application.